Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to embed some videos into your Weebly website uh, from various sources around the web. Uh, pretty much they all work the same way. If you find a cool video, for example on history.com, um, there will be some sites that will not allow you to embed them and you'll just have to include a link to that page. Uh, but for example in history.com, uh, if you go to a video, so here's one on World War I that I found, if you go ahead and uh, you click on this video, you'll see down here at the bottom there's something that says share. When you click on share, it'll give you several options. You can share it to Facebook, Twitter, StumbleUpon, or whatever. We're going to be looking for this little symbol right here. This is the embed code. It gives you an HTML code, which is basically website formatting. Um, once you get that, you just go ahead and here's your code, and then you're going to go ahead and copy it to your clipboard. And then you just go to your Weebly website and uh, you're going to go ahead and pull over uh, one of these little guys right somewhere right here you find the embed code and you're just going to go ahead and drag the embed code thing over and now we can go ahead and click on it and it says to copy the HTML code so we're just going to control V which is paste the code that we just got and then go ahead and click off of it and you will see the video should appear right here. Sometimes it doesn't show up right away and you have to publish it to make it show up. Um, so if you go ahead and we're going to go ahead and publish it. And then once it's published you go over to your website and see if it worked. Embedding videos is the page that we were on. And we will go ahead and scroll down. And there's our video right here from history.com. Uh, about World War One. Now you can also go to a lot of websites work that way for example if we go to CNN.com and we scroll down and we find a video that you're like wow this is like a current events thing that would really go well with my class for example in health I found one that's can Google pill detect cancer kind of recent uh, technology type stuff something you want to share with them so you go ahead and click on the video and you think wow this is a really cool video um, when it comes up, a lot of times you're going to have to sit through a tedious little um, advertisement. Go ahead and just pause that for right now. Um, up at the top of the page, again, you're going to look for that embed code. You can send a hyperlink or you can embed it. We're looking for embedding it. So in this case, it says the embed code was copied successfully. So then we'll go back to our Weebly website. And we're going to do the same thing we did on the last one. We're just going to go ahead and bring over the embed code and drag it in. And then it'll ask us for the HTML code again. And we're just going to go Control V, click off of it again. And your video should show up right there. There's the Google video that we just uploaded. Now, if we go back to YouTube, you have two options. Uh, with YouTube, you can just go ahead up here to the top and you can click on it, um, Control C and copy that HTML code and then when you go over back over to your Weebly website you can easily just click on um, the website spot that you've got here Oops, not that one we're gonna add in a new one you go over here and you add in a YouTube because it's got it already created you just go ahead and drag over your YouTube clip and from there it'll pull up this guy right here you just click on it and it'll ask for the URL, which is what we just copied, and you just control V. There's the URL. Click off of it. And there's your 10, can, 10 cool science experiments. Now, there's another way. Sometimes um, when you play a video from YouTube, it'll pop up all of the little um, recommended videos afterwards, and you can get some inappropriate things that'll pop up, and the kids will be like, why, why is there a woman in her bra on my screen or whatever? Um, you can avoid having those pop up, um, but you have to embed the video slightly differently. So instead of copying the URL, you'll go over here to share down underneath the video. And you get the embed code, which is what we did with the other videos. Um, and then you're going to go ahead and you hit uh, show more. And you're going to copy the embed code. So make sure you get the whole thing and control C, copy it. But then down underneath here, it says um, you've got a checkbox. You can either show suggested videos when the video finishes, which is those random videos that pop up with the woman with their bra on or whatever it is. Click that off, and then when the video's done, it won't recommend videos for the kids to click on, and it won't have those little pictures. 
Um, and then when you go back to the Weebly website, all you're going to do is instead of going to the YouTube thing, which asks for a link, you just go up here to the embed code, just like we did the other videos. You go ahead and drop it in there, and then it's going to ask for the HTML code. You control V, which is paste, and click off of it, and it should fill in right there. Now, again, sometimes it doesn't pop up right away, and you got to publish it to get it to show up. Um, so that's three different ways to embed videos that you don't have to create. You just got to borrow them and share them into your website.